Number 22. What is the area of a circle 3.102 centimeters in diameter? Okay, so for a problem like this, let's just draw a uh, simple picture. So let's draw a circle. Thank God for autocorrect. Okay, so we have a circle. And let's now detail the center. And let's uh, show the diameter, right? Because that's what's given in the problem. So let's just draw a simple diameter here. Okay, so now the diameter, this whole length here, this thing is going to be equal to 3.102 centimeters. Okay, so we have a, we have a picture. And let's now uh, see what the problem is asking us to do. It says to calculate the area, right? of a circle. So we need to know the formula of a circle uh, for the area specifically. So the area formula is going to be pi r squared. Okay, so did they tell us the radius? No, they did not. Uh, but they gave us the diameter. We just have to remember the relationship between the radius and the diameter, right? The radius is the distance between the center of the circle and the edge, whereas the diameter is the measure from one edge of the circle to the other edge that passes through the center. So it should kind of make sense that right, the radius is going to be always half of the uh, diameter. I can show it mathematically, but let's not get too bogged down with all the math. So let's just take 3.02 and divide it by two. Okay, so that comes out now to be a value of 1.551. And I'm gonna keep that whole value, right? Uh, my starting measurement value had four significant figures, therefore my ending value here should have four significant figures, which it does. Now what I can do is I can use this radius value in my calculation. Okay, so the area will now be equal to pi times the radius, which is 1.551 squared. Okay, so let's calculate it now, right? So it depends on, I'm gonna use the exact value for pi, all right, so that's not gonna be the limiting factor uh, of my significant figures here. Uh, what's going to be the limiting factor is going to be the measured radius, okay? So just remember that there are four significant figures, so my answer should have only four. All right, so let's take pi and multiply it by 1.551 squared. Okay, so this comes out to be 7.55, seven and that's how that's where i'm going to around it okay now just remember i didn't even include the units here but just what was given was centimeters right so therefore if the diameter was in centimeters and i just divided it by two the radius was in centimeters and the ra the the centimeters would have been squared and therefore my units here would have been centimeters squared and that sh should be the final answer all right, guys, that concludes this. If this helped you out at all, please do subscribe. Thank you so much.